In the previous two exercises, we created separate diagrams for the lithology and benzene logs. The 3D strip log designer does, however, allow for plotting multiple items. For example, we can turn on both the lithology and eye data and offset the columns within the log preview pane. The result? is a diagram that includes both the lithology and the benzene data. Unfortunately, details within these types of composite diagrams can be difficult to discern. To illustrate this point, consider some 3D strip logs with multiple attributes such as lithology, stratigraphy, fractures, and two types of geochemistry. The net result is a colorful but confusing diagram. The purpose of this exercise is to show a better way for viewing multiple data sets within 3D strip log diagrams. From the main Rockworks menu, select the Window Rock Plot 3D option. This will open up a copy of the Rock Plot 3D window. Select the File Open option. Pick the file titled lithologylogs.rw3d that we created during the previous exercise. Right click on the logs item within the data tree and select the Edit Title option. Change the title from Logs to Lithology. Next, select the File Append option. Pick the benzenelogs.rw3d file that we also created within the previous exercise. Rename this object group from Logs to Benzene. Appending the benzene logs also appended another copy of the perimeter cage, so let's get rid of it by right-clicking on one of the perimeter cage objects and selecting the Delete option. We can now turn data sets on and off to eliminate the confusion inherent within multi-attribute 3D logs. To save this new composite diagram, Select the File Save As option. Name this new file logs.rw3d. We'll end this exercise with a more realistic example showing how multiple geological, geophysical, geotechnical, and hydrological parameters can be independently displayed and combined within a single rock plot 3D diagram.